matter. Here's the deal. If you want, if you really love me and want to be with me, you have to prove it really well. So here's the deal. You have to go online, admit every single time you were abusive to me and apologize. Admit that you love me. Admit that you will do everything to work towards being a better person and towards our relationship because you want a future with me and you want to have babies with me in the future and you want to make things right and become a better person then maybe we'll talk. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. The purple mattress, take that white layer off. It's sunk into the mattress. Dee Dee, every time you sleep, you're sleeping on me, on my DNA. You are, so, oh my God, you're such a fucking liar. You're an idiot. And Alyssa, I'm blocking you for supporting him. Screw you. Anyone who supports him, and I see in his chat, I'm blocking. Like when I get home, I'm blocking you all who fucking support him. It's bullshit. He's a piece of shit liar. He's actually, if you actually believe that he never slept with me, you have mental brain damage, like worse than him. And I'm sorry, but Didi, you're gonna fucking open your big mouth now because now you, you don't have to protect him from the law. Maybe his probation officer would like to fucking know. You're full, oh my God. When I get home, a new set of screenshots is going to be revealed, my love. A whole new set of fucking screenshots proving you were with me the whole time. You're not allowed to. You were let out on bond on the condition you weren't to see me. I didn't have that rule. I didn't. I was allowed. So guess what? You're in shit. You're a fucking liar. You are a piece of crap. Liar, 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 liar! I fucking hate him, guys. I swear to God. I, I've seen, I saw Alyssa's fucking super giant fuck you. You're fake. I don't want any fucking fake beezers in here. All of you are fucking fake and I'm blocking you all when I get home. I need to cut this fucking piece of shit parasite and all the negativity from my fucking life. I cannot handle this shit anymore. It's not a fucking joke to me anymore. I'm done. I'm fucking done. He's making me fucking mental. Like he really makes me mental. I have to stop letting him get to me. I'm gonna show all my bank statements. I just fucking sent you $500 the other day, you fucking broke piece of shit. Every single thing in your life was paid for by me. Everything. And you're gonna sit there smug on panel with Dee Dee? You fucking... Mm, I hate them. I fucking hate them. You are going to be fucking revealed. You wait. You fucking wait. you dumb ass I can go back to the cops anytime I want to and report charges on you for the last time you fucking smacked me across the face at Hotel Monville when I didn't order you fucking octopus because you're a piece of shit get your own you fucking grifter oh my god I hate him I don't know what I ever saw in him I don't know the fact that I came on here and defended him so much I just want to throw up Something he never did for me, because you're a piece of crap. Go look at, oh, I've given him so much, you have no idea. Well, you, you guys all know that, and you all know I'm stupid. But he's such a liar, and it's just, oh, I can't, I can't. Mm. You know what? I should go fucking back to the police station and be like, this guy is fucking, he hit me? He's still talking shit about me? And get another fucking peace bond on him, because that's fucking bullshit. Like, I'm serious. Like, he's going to drive me nuts. Like, I cannot, I cannot deal. I, like, I need to quit YouTube. Like, I cannot deal with seeing his fucking ugly fucking face and her fucking face on the same platform as my, as me. Like, I can't handle it. I cannot fucking handle it. Like, I can't. So when I get home, I'm going to be blocking people who are just over there supporting him. Because fuck you. All the way fuck you. Thank you. liar look at the bed the villa really at least i pay my own fucking bills at least i pay the rent for the villa you fucking broke bum who pays the rent on that you're gonna talk about her apartment like it's yours that's all you ever do all you ever do you big stupid bum fucking leech off other people that's all you do is leech off of other people 
What have you paid for one thing? And then you try to get money for me to pay back Didi because you fucking leech off her too? Oh, I'm gonna show those. I'm gonna show those. I'm gonna show it. I have so many messages under Krista B. Zion. You wanna out Krista B. Zion? Krista B. Zion will screw you over, bitch. Guess what, broke bitch? Krista B. Zion is gonna screw you over. Yeah, because you know what? You, in that messages, have said so many times, I need cigarettes. Can you send me money? I'm broke. Send me money. I need to pay back Didi. Fuck you and fuck Didi. And I know Didi, she's admitted to me she's not good with money like her other members of her family. She's a broke bitch too. She fucking makes money, but she spends it. She's an Aries and she's bad with money. Have fun supporting him because he's expensive, girl. He's expensive and have fun getting STDs because if you think he's not going to cheat on you, you're dreaming. He fucked me in your purple bed many, many, many times. You don't think he's going to fucking do it? Oh, but no, you're just his friend, right? If you're such his friend, then why are you so fucking crying bullshit every time I go pick him up? Oh, what about my feelings, Natter? <laughs> what about my comb over, Natter? What about my great twat, Natter? Fuck you! And you don't even talk about me and my fupa. You have a dick that's stretched out from having gonorrhea and has stretch marks on it. Any woman who wants to go near that biohazard, have fun. Have fun. Have fucking fun with that. Holding his dick, looking at it like, what's this green shit coming out of it? Oh, I wonder. Maybe don't fuck hookers on the porch. Fucking hookers on the porch. I come over one day at four in the morning, this fucking woman. Thought it was a fucking garbage bag. Has candles lit, condoms all around her. Who are you? Oh, I know the man that lives here. Comes downstairs. Oh, I don't know her. Hmm. Oh, sure. You got to pregnant. I'm sure you're a father now. You dirty scumbag. And then charging me 150 bucks for coke when it's probably only 80. Charging me 300 for shrooms. Giving the rest of my cocaine to your fucking ex-girlfriend. And then being like it was her birthday. Can you believe this asshole? Can you fucking believe this asshole? Forever falling for that asshole? <laughs> Dude, lay off the speed. Everyone can see you. Like, you're freaking, you're fucking insane. Anyways, God. I'm glad I shot up that speed. I did you a fucking favor. You're probably gonna fucking die of a heart attack or emphysema the way you smoke cigarettes. And drink wine. Now you and Didi can be drunkies together at night. Have fun with your life. You know it's gonna be shit. Why else would you, okay, D, if he loves Dee Dee so much, why is he trying to move in with me and get away from her? Dude, I have so many messages, you are gonna be fucked. And by the end of it, Dee Dee's gonna wanna kick your ass out too. So where are you gonna go, huh? Where are you gonna go, the Ferris wheel? You probably don't even have money to ride the Ferris wheel. Ugh. You fucked with the wrong one, Nader. you. This, you made me crazy. This is your fault, so you can eat it up and live with the consequences. I don't feel bad for you at all. So what else happened in our non-relationship? You know what? Actually, by making videos talking about things that happened to me while I was with you, I could probably earn some of my fucking money back that you took from me, or that I gave to you. Yes, I did give you the money. Yes, I did give you the money, because I fucking loved you, or I thought I loved you, and I cared about you. Shame on me. So guess what? Guess what? He, he, it's so funny the facade he puts on. Yeah, so I'm moving to Montreal with a friend. Just gonna stay with her just for a little bit while I get my job. I got a job lined up and making it look like he's got his shit all together. Meanwhile, behind the fucking scenes, he's stressing out because he didn't pay his fucking April rent. Because, uh, so the landlord's up his ass. He's struggling. I have to fucking, I pay for movers to go move all his shit. He doesn't have a job. That's obvious. I mean, um, what else? And he, like, obviously cannot leave Didi's. Like, because I said no for the apartment, now he's fucked. So he's all pit probably pissed off and gonna talk about me bad. You look like a dumbass, you know that? Like, I'm not on here talking about how ugly you are and everything because I fucked you. So I'm not gonna look like a stupid asshole talking about how gross you are all the time and how fat and ugly or how scrawny and ugly you are because I fucked you. So if I made fun of you after I fucked you over and over, I would look like an asshole making fun of you. Guess what, Natter? You look like an asshole. <laughs> yeah, buddy.